My name is Britton Sutphin. I go to Colorado School of Medicine and I'm a second year. My junior year of high school, I decided to join the swim team and uh, that's when I had my sudden cardiac arrest. So what kind of got me into medicine was experiencing two different kinds of care. So I think just seeing like the difference between those two inspired me to be a doctor and one who like listens to their patients. One of my biggest worries about medical school is just how I'm going to retain everything <laughs> for so long. The immensity of information. <laughs> I feel like as soon as I study something and feel like I have that down, then I try to move on to the next topic. And then once I've mastered that topic, I forget all the things I've just learned. And pigmonics definitely helped with that. If on an exam it says like a certain bacteria, I can just pull up that still image in my mind and try to like identify where everything is. Especially for like drugs, if it says, you know, what's a side effect of this drug, I can just picture the pigmonic and I can literally just list them out. I like the shortness of the videos. I think like the main thing for me was the space repetition feature was that you know I could log on every day and it could say hey you have you have to review these that way if I like get something right it feels like I don't have to see it as much and then the ones that I'm getting wrong I like see more mm -hmm. so it keeps everything fresh aside from obviously helping me succeed on exams like first and second year I definitely think it has like more long-term utility having success third year during rounds and clinical years and I've talked to some people who like use Picmonic um, and now they're in their residency and they can still picture Picmonics. I feel like pictures stay with you longer than just words.